The mayor's little helpers were busy today packing hundreds of hampers for the city's less fortunate. The production line at the Fred Mool Pavilion was in full swing early on. The goods were bought with $70,000 raised by the community in the mayor's Christmas appeal. We hit the target pretty early and uh, this year we're going on beyond it. So what will happen is we'll probably have a credit going into next year. You've got your ham, your Christmas ham, um, you've got baked beans, spaghetti, um, uh, soft drink, uh, some lollies, um, cereal. 700 hampers were packed in cans and 100 in Port Douglas. They'll be delivered to members of the community in the coming weeks. The man's Christmas appeal gathers momentum. food hampers will be delivered to the less fortunate across Camden, Port Douglas this festive season. Dozens of volunteers today donated their time to packing them to ensure that everyone has a happy Christmas. Each year, Cairns Regional Council fundraises to ensure less fortunate families will have basic food staples over Christmas. In order to make it happen, an army of volunteers is needed and Cairns never disappoints. It's a great measure of a community showing care for those who are less fortunate or who are perhaps going through harder times. Volunteers from Rotary, the Navy, Telstra and the FNQ Heat all stock donated goods into hampers today to be delivered to families throughout Cairns. And this is one way that uh, perhaps uh, their Christmas can be made that little bit happier. Volunteers from all over the world rolled up their sleeves today. I'm from Denmark and uh, yeah, I'm a Rotary so we're just helping out where we can. The Mayor's Christmas Appeal manages to bring the entire community together, even with our armed forces. It's part of a neighbour community. Uh, we get very, very involved in um, helping the community around the Cairns uh, area and also in far north Queensland. Donations for the appeal are still coming in. We hit the target pretty early and uh, this year we're going on beyond it. So what will happen is we'll probably have a credit going into next year. Ensuring next year's Christmas is just as festive. Matthew Howard, Win News.